Hello everyone, for many people, WeChat dual opening is a very important requirement. Two WeChat apps are installed on one single mobile phone at the same time, and two WeChat apps log into two different WeChat accounts. One WeChat account is used to communicate with colleagues at work, and another one WeChat account is used for relatives, friends, and private communication. And work and life can be completely separated without affecting each other using different WeChat account. Android phones generally have their own WeChat dual opening functions, such as Huawei mobile phones and Xiaomi mobile phones. Both of them have their own WeChat dual opening functions, but iPhone does not have this function, which is a pain point of iPhone users. Well, today I have a very good news to share with you. I find a method to implement WeChat dual opening on one single iPhone, and I will share it with you. Okay, let's move to my iPhone. Let's go. Okay, now welcome to my iPhone. You can see from my desktop, I've already installed two TikTok and two WeChat. So this TikTok and this WeChat I installed from the App Store. Using the App Store, install this, this TikTok and this WeChat. But this uh, copy of the TikTok and the copy of the WeChat, the dual app, I mean this is a dual app I uh, use to the, use the uh, side loadly to install the second WeChat and install the second TikTok. So I can log in uh, my different two accounts using the using this WeChat. So different account can be logged in to the WeChat and to the WeChat and to the TikTok to a TikTok. So it is very useful if you have two different account for the TikTok and different account for the WeChat. So I will show you see the TikTok. This is a one TikTok and this is my second TikTok. So you can see so I can um, see the videos of my two different account. And this is my my one WeChat account. This is my second WeChat account. So I can uh, communicate with my friends, with my colleagues. So I can use my two different account. So I can use it very easily to separate the uh, communication. For example, which I click this my first my one WeChat account, and I can uh, say hello, 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 and uh, then I will send it. So my second WeChat will receive this. Uh, See here, my second WeChat will receive this message, and I can say hi, and send it to my this WeChat. So you can see hi. So I can communicate with each other. So I can use this uh, WeChat to communicate with my colleague, and using this WeChat, I can communicate with my private uh, friends, my private uh, relatives, some for the private purpose. Yeah, this is very useful for you if you want to, to do an app using your different account to log in. Okay, next I will show you how to uh, using the side loadly to install the second uh, WeChat. Uh, okay, so now I will delete the second WeChat, remove the app and delete the app, delete. I will delete it and I will show you how to use inside Loadly to install it uh, for the, your dual app, your second to log in to your second account. Okay, let's move to my PC. Okay, now welcome to my PC. So first we need to open this web link, the Side Loadly official website. I will put this link down below this video's description so you can click the link to visit this official website. So on this website we need to scroll down to see here you need to download for Windows. Please make sure you have the web version of iTunes installed. If you do not install the non-Microsoft Store version from this link, so you can click this link for your 6.4, 6, uh, 6 bit uh, Windows. If you are using Windows 10, so if you are using the 32 bit, then you click this one to download the iTunes of the for the 32 bit. So for me, I will click this one x uh, 64 bit because I'm using the Windows 10 64 bit. So because I already in, uh, downloaded, so I will no need to download again. Okay. Then another um, uh, hint is that uh, additionally, although iCloud is not required, installing it does, does, mean, uh, does seem to help resolve some issues users have been reporting. You can install the non-Microsoft Microsoft Store version from the link here. 
So if you have, um, if you met any issues uh, with the uh, installation, then uh, I recommend that you d download this uh, um, iCloud. So iCloud and install this I I iCloud. But for me, uh, I mean on my Windows 10, uh, system. There's no need for me to install this uh, iCloud. I can uh, install this uh, iTunes. That's enough for me to install the iTunes for me. Okay, you need to download the iTunes and the next one is to download Side Loadly here. This Side Loadly, if you are using Windows 64 bit, then download here. You are, you are using Windows 32 bit, download here. So if you are using Mac, or Mac OS, Mac OS, download here. For me, I, I'm using Windows 10, so I will download this link 64-bit. Okay, because I already downloaded it, so I don't, don't need to download it again. Okay, this is the first website, and the second website is this one. I will also put this web link down below this uh, description, video description. You need to download this uh, WeChat IPA file, this WeChat IP, IPA file. The file size is around 189 megabytes. So click this blue button to download this uh, WeChat. For me, I already downloaded, so I don't need to download again. Okay, for uh, let's move to my folder, to this folder here. And you can see I already downloaded the WeChat, the side loadly, and the iTunes. Okay, so now let's first we let's install the iTunes 34 set up. Set up. So double click this uh, application and click next. And if you want to use iTunes as the default player for audio files, then you click this in. But for me, I don't need to click this in and uh, tick out. So I click install to install iTunes for me. Then pop up this window and then you click yes. So it will install the iTunes onto your PC. Okay, just to finish the installation. So open iTunes after the installation. Okay, let's click finish. So. My, uh, so this iTunes will be opened. Okay, then we minimize this iTunes and the second step is to install the side loadly. Click, double click side loadly and click next, next, install. It's very easy to install the side loadly. Okay, then run side loadly. We, maybe we, we don't run it immediately. You click this out, create a desktop shortcut. Yes, tick in and click finish. So we finished the installation of the side loadly. Let's have a check. You can see the side loadly is here, iTunes is here. So I will double click the side loadly to open the side loadly to see. Okay, then it said uh, there's uh, some data needed to be uh, downloaded. It will take about uh, 150 to 200 big megabytes of the library to uh, fix some bugs. Okay, let's. I will click yes to download it. Then just wait for several seconds. It depends on your internet band speed. Okay, finish the download and installing. Now it will reopen this uh, side loadly. So okay, it's very easy. Then next step is we need to uh, communicate. We need to connect our iPhone with our PC. So use a USB cable. Here I will connect my iPhone with my PC, okay? So if you are the first time to connect with your iPhone, then there will be pop-up window here, which will say if you trust this PC. Then you need to always trust this PC, to click that button, always trust this PC, because I'm, I'm already uh, previously connected with my PC, so there's no uh, pop-up window, pop window for me, okay? So after that, then you just uh, op open your iPhone like they don't lock your screen, just uh, um, just based on this uh, screen is open, so not lock your screen. I put the iPhone aside, and then the next step is we need to use the side loadly to uh, install uh, the WeChat here. I will move my folder here, and I will click this drag this WeChat IPA file to this here to here drag the IPA file WeChat here then you can see uh, just click the start button and because I'm already used this uh, side loadly so my uh, Apple ID is already here so if you are the first time using the side loadly then you need to key in your Apple ID and then you need to click start if you are first time using there will be um 
password pop up window um, pop up for you you need to key in your password of your apple id and if you are uh, activated your two-step authorization then you need to key in the uh, two-step authorization code from your iphone the code iphone and the key in your authorization code of your two-step authorization onto into the side locally then it can uh, install this ipa i mean the wechat ipa file into your iphone okay you just uh, waiting for several minutes it is signing you can see it is signing and it is installing the IPA onto your mobile phone iPhone and you can see please keep your device screen on so you need to keep your screen device screen on not lock your screen okay now you can see done here 100% done here which means the uh, WeChat dual app already uh, installed successfully let's have a look of our iPhone here so uh, the, you can see this WeChat, the dual app is already here. So the, uh, all the work on the PC is done. So next we need to unplug this uh, USB cable. So all now outstanding steps is on my iPhone. Okay, let's move to my iPhone. Okay, now here you can see the WeChat is here. So we click this WeChat, open it. Then you can see there's a warning said untrusted developer, which means we need to trust our Apple ID on, in our settings. Okay, we click cancel, no problem. We click the settings and go to general here. We go to the general here, this one, and drop down to the this one, VPN and device management. And click this one, VPN device management, and you can see my Apple ID is already here. Set not trusted. So we click this, my Apple ID, and click trust my Apple ID. Click that one, trust, and click the red character trust so that's all for for these settings and go back to the desktop and we click this wechat so now you can see the wechat can the dual app of the second app is opened and click allow so next you can using your another wechat account to log in here or to sign up to log in or to sign up so then you can use two different wechat account using at the same time so and uh, for the TikTok, you can also use the same way to install the dual app of the TikTok. You can, you can use two TikTok at the same time. This method of installing this uh, dual, dual app valid for seven days. So after seven days, you need to repeat the process. I mean, the repeat the process to refresh your signature. So here, I will see. So you will need to, um, so you will need to connect your iPhone with a PC again and uh, drag and drag this uh, WeChat to here again and then click start to install again onto your iPhone. If seven days later the signature is out of date, then you need to repeat this process to refresh your signature and to uh, use the WeChat again. So seven days again, seven days again, you can repeat this process to use WeChat forever. So this is, I think, is a very convenient way for you to do that and with no, with no free, it's free of charge. Very easy to use. Okay, so if you like my sharing, don't forget to thumb up and see you next time. Bye-bye.